Youths in Oyo State on the platform of the All Progressives Congress APC have organized a summit tagged a political party without active youth participation, a case for the Sorosuke generation. The event, which held on Friday, was aimed at enlightening young people on the importance of participating actively in politics. This next report tells us more. These youth are gathered here with one aim to push for representation in Nigeria's politics ahead of the 2023 elections. Stakeholders of the All Progressives Congress in Oyo say the summit would redirect the focus of the youth to values that truly matter in good governance. There must be three C, the character, the competence, and the courage to implement. The moment you have that three C, that is all. And I hope and pray our children and our brothers will have that determination to take this country to where we ought to be. If we want to build a new generation of leaders, we need to understand the importance of orientation. Because our problem is not the government. Our problem is orientation. We practice democracy. Democracy is the government of the people, made by the people and for the people. So it's always about the people. So if we don't, first of all, reorient orientate and reorientate the people, they will not be able to you know, achieve our aim. And that is why lead generation is moving from one state to another to train uh, youth that are ready to challenge the status quo. But the passion is not enough. We need knowledge. We need strategies. We need to be able to build on that. So I think the Sorosoke generation has woken up, but it's much more than that. We're going to have to do much more than wake up. We're going to have to strategize. We're going to have to plan. And we're going to have to take, you know, take charge. Keynote speaker M.M. Osai and a member of the summit's planning committee harped on the relevance of youth participation in national development and called on youth to be engaged in politics beyond the end SARS movement. The conveners expect that after the summit, more Nigerian youth will become more involved in politics to create the change they desire to see in Nigeria in 2023 and beyond. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.